Hello, this is Brian Casey of The Imaging Wire. We are here at SIM 2024, the annual meeting of the Society for Imaging Informatics and Medicine. And we are here with Dr. Raj Chopra. He is Chief Medical Officer of Merge by Meredith. Dr. Chopra, thanks for being with us. Thanks for having me. So, uh, Dr. Chopra, you, you joined Merge uh, earlier this year as Chief Medical Officer. You're a, a trained radiologist. So can you talk a little bit about your new role and, and um, kind of what you bring to Merge? So yeah, I've been a, I'm a radiologist that's approaching, oh my gosh, 20 years. Um, I've uh, been in all facets of radiology, uh, but primarily on the ground, uh, being a radiologist day to day, pounding through the lists, doing the work that all of us do as radiologists uh, has been my primary focus. So coming to this position from being a radiologist, what are some of the big issues that you see facing radiologists and then what are, how, how can imaging IT help? That's a great question. It's a difficult time for radiology right now. Um, the number of cases that are coming in on any given day is rising exponentially. Our baby boomers are getting older, so more images are coming through. Uh, people are going through the ER quite a bit, lots of imaging coming through. And we had, after COVID, just like every other specialty, uh, a, a big retirement. And so now we have to figure out tools and ways to make that pressure of all that volume of work uh, you know, take it off the bur take that burden off radiologists, and uh, we're trying to do our best to to take the burden off, to increase our accuracy, and to to make diagnoses that are are relevant and right the first time. So, what are some of the ways that imaging IT can help? A, lo a lot of people say, well, maybe with AI we can have we can a have AI read some of the cases that are normal. You know, maybe we can improve radiologist workflow. What are some of the the ways that that imaging IT can help? Yeah, I mean, I think. It, it, you've got to start with the fundamentals, right? So every day we're working with tools that uh, have to work. So at Merge, we really focus on not having downtimes. We have stability. That's an important part of it because if the work piles up and then you can't do the work, then more work is piling on top of it. So that that's key. Our, we have a, um, our Merge Universal Viewer. It's streamlined. It's quick. It's agile. Anything that takes seconds off each exam, as you can imagine, um, adds up. So. Um, that's really important for us. And then uh, we have this tool called the, uh, the Merge Worklist Orchestrator. It is a smart tool, it's a smart work list, kind of guides w uh, you know, work distribution so the proper radiologist gets the right study for them. So there's more efficiency, more accuracy. That's hugely important. And, and the whole process is on a backbone of, of our cloud, and, and which is, if it increases our efficiency and decreases costs. So we're here at SIM at uh, day two. W what are some of the things that you've seen here at SIM, some of the technologies that maybe have gotten you most excited? Um, a, a lot of the cloud native stuff. Uh, the, you know, b going to cloud is a difficult thing for organizations to figure out right now. Um, uh, there's a, a, a strong contingent of folks that want to stay on the old legacy. They're comfortable there. Uh, but in order to use the tools that we're seeing here at SIM, you need to be in, the, in an environment that can handle the bandwidth. And unfortunately, on-prem solutions are, are just having a very difficult time with that. So if you want to use AI to help your radiologist, if you want to use those kind of things, you, know, you, have, to, you have to start moving to the cloud. And, and do you see that happening? And do you see health systems starting to say, look, I need to get my, my image management off the premises and get it on the cloud? They're starting to get there. There's a, like I told you, there's, there's a there's a big worry about that. That's what makes Merge's tools kind of interesting is that you can piecemeal your way to cloud. You don't have to, a lot of solutions out there right now make you go big bang. And a lot of big organizations, big change is scary. Um, so Merge allows you to systematically do it on your timeline, not on our timeline. And that makes it a little bit easier. But yes, all organizations are going to move there eventually. So uh, we're at about the midpoint of 2024. Uh, what can we hope to see from uh, Merge in the, for the rest of the year through our SNA season? I, we're really focused on uh, radiologists. We're really focused on how to make their lives better. So a lot of our products are, are working towards that. But the downtime piece, I can't emphasize enough. Uh, we're really working on things to make sure that Merge is functioning all the time. Um, also, the, the 
like I said, the, the, the merge work list orchestrator has items already built into it, but we're also working on things in the background to make it even better. And those tools will make radiologists' lives easier. And it's all about that efficiency, that, that, that what can we do to make their lives simpler? Very good. Well, stuff to look forward to. Yeah, I'm super excited. Dr. Raj Chopra of Merge by Meredith, thanks for being with us today. Thank you. All right. Signing off from SIM 2024, my name is Brian Casey. <laughs>